This project is creating the crypto alternative to Zoom and Google Meets. It already has thousands of users and a working product. The project allows you to run a node on a PC that is helping to build this super fast, decentralized, real-time communication network. The nodes are super rare and there's an exclusive pre-sale happening on the 6th and the 7th of October. The project has raised over $5.5 million in funding and is backed by some serious players in the space. And make sure you stay till the end of the video as I've got you exclusive access and a whitelist spot for the sale that's going to get you 10% off and I've got an additional 10% off with my discount code Passive Crypto. That's over 20% in savings just because you're a follower of this channel. But you have to hurry as the deadline for registering for the whitelist is going to be on the 5th of November 2024. But don't click off if you're watching after this date. You can still learn about this project and you can access the public sale which is going to go live from the 8th of November and you can still use my discount code. And you can start earning just two weeks after you make your purchase. In this video, I'll quickly remind you about the deadlines for registering for the node sale. I'll go in depth on the project and what it's trying to achieve. I'll then look at the team, the backing and the funding that they have, as well as the partnerships. We'll then look at the media nodes and how you can benefit from purchasing one of these and what they actually do. And finally, I'll show you how you can register for this whitelist sale so that you can get in early and get the maximum rewards. All right, let's jump straight into the video. Right, first things first, before I tell you about this project, I need to tell you that the whitelist is launching on the 6th of November. So depending on when you watch this video, it could be in time for signing up for that. The public sale is on the 8th of November, so you still have chance to get hold of this if you are not in the whitelist. But if you're watching it in good time, I wanna tell you how you can prepare. And the reason you wanna prepare is it's first come, first serve. So if you're in the whitelist, you get a better chance of getting a tier one node at the lowest price because the the price of the node increases and the second benefit is if you get into my whitelist you get 10% off simply for being in the whitelist and then you get an additional 10% if you use the code passive crypto so you could get up to 20% off if you register on my whitelist form now the deadline to register is the 5th of November at 12 30 a.m. EST or 4 a.m. UTC worry not if you've missed that deadline because the public sale is going to open on the 8th of November so you still have time to get 10% off if you make use of that but I want to direct you to that link in the description sign up for the whitelist if you are there before the deadline and once you've signed up to that whitelist let's carry on with the rest of this project right let's head into the huddle 01 website so we can learn a little bit more about this project and what it's trying to achieve and we can see straight away from the homepage that Huddle is a decentralized real-time communication network and is dedicated to making audio video communication faster, cheaper and more importantly powered by the people. It is a deep end that utilizes unused internet bandwidth to provide lag-free borderless connectivity across many different industries like gaming, AI, metaverse, socials, and so forth. Now, the exciting thing about Huddle is that it's building the world's first deep in for real-time communication. Now, you may recognize some other real-time communication software, Zoom being the biggest, you've got Skype, Google Meet, Microsoft Teams, well, the list goes on and on. But what Huddle is trying to build is a decentralized real-time communication network. So it sits somewhere in the middle between bandwidth projects and compute projects and some of the other projects that we're aware of in the deep in space. In fact, the decentralized real-time communication category was pioneered by Huddle01 and so it's one of very few in this small sector. But there is a huge problem that they are trying to solve in the real-time communication network. So what is it that they're trying to solve? What is it that Zoom and Microsoft Teams and Google Meets has, which is still a problem? Well, number one, there are high operational costs. Huddle One actually is 95% cheaper than any of its competitors in the space. Well, the second one is geographical latency. The further you are to your data center, the more latency you are going to have. And we can see from this chart here that 33% of data centers are actually in the United States. Well, that's not a share of the global data center reach. If I'm speaking to somebody in Indonesia, it's being routed to a data center in America. Well, that just cannot be efficient, can it? The third issue is privacy. Now, you may not know, but some of the famous companies like Zoom and also even with Amazon Web Services, they were known to be listening into people's data. And that's something which can be controlled with blockchain. And the last one, of course, is value extraction. At the moment, all of your data is going to these 
monopolize companies and you're not earning an income from it. And that's what Huddle01 is trying to resolve. Now, Huddle actually has an awesome origin story. It started in 2020 when the founders of this project realized that users in their home country, which was India, during the corona lockdown, they had to listen to classes over Zoom. But the quality of the stream was so bad that they were relying on WhatsApp calls just to try and transcribe that. And so they realized that there is an issue that exists in the world and they want to fix it. And so that's what they went and they did. And they've actually got a number of apps. So they've got Huddle01, which is a all-in-one communication platform. It's been live for a year. It's got over 40,000 users, 5 million minutes of online time, and they've had over 160,000 meetings. And it's got its own revenue model. So this is a company with a product that is already generating a revenue. They've also got another product, which is created for Farcaster, and that's called Farhouse. And that's got over a million minutes itself in online time. Now, they've also got something called SDKs. Now, SDKs are software development kits. So these are plug and play kits that they can give to developers who can integrate them into their own framework. And you can see some of the frameworks here. You might recognize Unity, for example. And that's had over a million minutes of real-time communication. So you can see already that they've got 7 million plus minutes and thousands of users that are using their software at the moment. And the reason that they are beating their competitors is because they are 95% cheaper than the existing infrastructure. Because of the ability to deploy decentralized nodes, and we'll be talking about those, of course, later on in the video, that's going to improve performance and scalability. There is privacy because it's encrypted end-to-end -end using blockchain technology. And the economy here is not top-down, but it's bottom-up. We are generating revenues and rewards from the bottom of the project. So you can have a look here at the ecosystem to Huddle One. You've got these software development kits that's going to be going to developers that they can integrate that into existing frameworks. You've obviously got the media powerhouse. This is what users are going to purchase. Clients are going to consume the bandwidth for. And then you have the media nodes. That's what we, me and you, have the option to purchase. And of course, whitelist for in this video. We'll be supplying the bandwidth that is going to be powering this media network. Now, they've got a super detailed white paper if you want to check that out on the website. And they've also got a decent docs page if you wanted to learn more about the project. But that's what Huddle01 is in a nutshell. Okay, let's head into talking about the team, some of the backing and also the partnerships. Now, you can see that this is a fully docs team. They're accessible on X and also on LinkedIn. When you go on the X, actually, you can see that they are quite live. They do a lot of interviews. There's been a few podcasts on them as well. And the founder and the co-founder, they really have this awesome origin story that I told you about. And they've gone on to build an amazing team. And as you can see, what I love about projects, not only that are fully doxxed, but they've also got a fully fleshed out team with a building revenue model. And even though they started not long ago, this project has already raised five and a half million dollars from a series of investors. And there are some super awesome ones like A Capital, Protocol Labs, Hivemind that have invested into this project. And so they have backing behind them, funding behind them, which gives us huge optimism for the launch that they have coming up. And if we have a look at the roadmap, we can see that Testnet was announced, some early partners were getting onboarded, and the media nodes whitelist was open. Of course, this video is towards the end of that. And then there's going to be the node sale that's coming up in November. Incentivized Testnet is gonna happen two weeks after the node sale. And then we're gonna have the staking protocol and mainnet, as well as the token launch, is expected in quarter one of 2025. So there's a lot to look forward to with the future of this project. So let's have a look at the media node themselves. What is it that that they are actually contributing towards the network. So these nodes are going to provide essential resources such as CPU and bandwidth. So you're going to be providing some idle CPU usage and also idle bandwidth towards this project. Now, the power of decentralized nodes means that it doesn't need a lot from single PCs, but collectively it can combine that power. And you can have a look from the diagram here that the media nodes are going to provide bandwidth. In return, they're going to earn the huddle token. Now that's going to be generated by the decentralized real-time communication protocol and the users are going to be consuming bandwidth and they're going to be paying for the services, which of course is going to go towards the media nodes holders. And that's kind of the ecosystem that the media nodes are going to allow us to achieve. So you have the opportunity, of course, to purchase tokens, but here to earn a passive income, you're going to earn the huddle token when you run one of these nodes and 21% of the total allocation has actually been put aside for node holders. There are 20,000 nodes across 10 tiers with the starting price of 0.122 
per node. Now that's around $320, but actually if you're in the pre-sale, you get 10% off. And if you use my passive crypto discount code, you get an additional 10% off. So you'll be getting 20% off that total amount. That's nearly $60 that you'll be getting off if you get involved here. Whitelist, as I've mentioned, is on the 6th of November with the public sale on the 8th of November. And you can still use the discount code passive crypto if you're involved in the public sale. Payments are in the warped Ethereum, and I'll show you how to do that later on in the video on the Arbitrum network. Now, there are 40 million HODL tokens that are going to be available during the testnet, and you're going to be earning around five HODL a day. And you can see here the different tiers. They are first come, first served, and the price of the tiers actually increased by 10%, depending on which tier you are able to get yourself in. So, of course, you want to make sure that you get in as early as possible. And some of the rewards you can see, you get 21% of the HODL supply. You get 5% HODL per day for the first six months. You have a very Testing period of two years and 20% are actually unlocked at token generation, which is going to be quarter one of 2025. Now running these nodes are super easy. They've got a minimum and recommended hardware requirements, four or eight cores of CPU, again, four or eight gigabyte of RAM, 32 gigabytes of disk space, and you want a minimum of 250 megabytes per second internet connection. Of course, the higher you have, the more you're going to earn. Now, worry not if you don't have the compute power or the ability to host them at the moment. They have partnered with Node Ops, which is a node as a service operator that I partner with. And you can actually delegate your nodes to run on a separate server, either yourself, a virtual server, or you can delegate it to a node as a service provider. So you have that option if you don't have the specs available to host these nodes at the moment. Right, let's head into the last part of this video, which is showing you exactly how you can register for the white sale and how you can get your wallet ready and prepared to purchase these nodes, whether you're in the whitelist from the 6th of November or you're going to be purchasing from the public sale on the 8th of November. Let's jump into that now. Okay, so the last part of the video, how do you get into this whitelist with the short time that we have available? Well, step number one is going to be going to this whitelist form. Now, the deadline for this form is Tuesday, the 5th of November at 4 a.m. UTC or 12.30 a.m. EST because they need time to get those whitelisted addresses. The sale itself is going to open on the 6th of November at 12.30 a.m. EST. But worry not if you haven't got in on the sale already. The 9th of November is going to be the public sale, so you still get access to that with the 10% discount code passive to when you make your purchase. Now, first thing you want to do is fill out the form with your email address, your whitelist wallet address, and then also your name, your last name, and your Discord handle or your Twitter handle, and then simply click Submit. That will get you in as long as you do that before the deadline. Now, the next thing you need to do is make sure that the Arbitrum network is on your wallet and that you have the wrapped Ether token that you use to purchase this node. I'm going to show you how you can do that right now. Step one is to add the Arbitrum 1 network to your wallet. I'll have this link in the description to Chainlist. You simply click on Add to MetaMask and then in your wallet, you'll have Arbitrum 1 selected as one of the networks that you can choose. By default, you'll have Ethereum, which is on the Arbitrum chain. Now, you need something called warped Ethereum. How do you get hold of that? Now, the easiest way to do that is to send some Ethereum to this wallet. There are two ways you can do that. If you have Ethereum on any other chain, you can simply go to this link. I'll put it in the description. Choose the chain that you have Ethereum. You might have Ethereum on the Ethereum chain. You might have it on another chain. Then you select Arbitrum 1. And you can simply move that Ethereum from the Ethereum network to the Arbitrum 1 network. The second option is if you have Binance. And this is probably the easiest option because if you send Ethereum to Binance, you can then send that Ethereum back through the Arbitrum network to your MetaMask wallet. So you should have some Ethereum in your MetaMask wallet. Now, all you simply need to do is click swap, choose Ethereum. And then from here, you're going to type in BET wrapped. And that's the token that you can purchase this node in. Simply enter the amount that you want to convert. Make sure you have a little bit left over for gas fees and then click convert and that will get you, you eat in your wallet in preparation for the sale. Now, if you're watching this video after the deadline for the whitelist, fill out the form because I'll send an email once the public sale goes live. So you'll be the first to hear about what's going on with this project. Right. That's it from me with this short time sensitive video. I hope you make the most of it and I'll catch you in the next video. And if you like these types of crypto nodes, why not check this one out here? Right, that's it from me. I'll catch you in the next video.